Hey guys, it's Ray with another Rigtolic tip. Today we're going to reset an accelerator. So as you can see, the accelerator is currently off. It's at zero. Our system is with pressure about approximately 18 psi. That might not be. That might be a little bit high for some systems, but these ones here are set for 18 psi. So first thing I like to do is with the accelerator off and the other system isolated, we're just gonna open the fast fill valve, okay? And we're just gonna shoot some air through the directional check valve here. So here we are, we're gonna just, okay? You shot some air through. That's just gonna push, push the airway through in case it's blocked with a little bit of water. Open this up, listen. That sounds like it's all air. If there's any water, you want to get all the water out. The last thing you want is any moisture to get up, built up, calm up water and block this. This is designed to block water. So it'll block your air pressure, which means that your system accelerator will only be basically monitoring from here to here. It's the slightest increase or decrease in pressure, it'll fall strip. So that's the key thing. So here we are, we're gonna open this up. We're gonna shut the top valve off, open the bottom valve. And as you can see, the pressure went the same up top as it is below. So that means we're good to go. And that is how you set a Victolic accelerator.